Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing my toiletry bag must-haves and this is perfect for any type of vacation whether I'm going on a three-day weekend getaway, a seven-day cruise, or a two-week out-of-the-country travel. This is my go-to. So if you're wanting some ideas for your own toiletry bag, make sure to keep watching or feel free to pack along with me and use this video as your ultimate toiletry packing guide. So this is a toiletry bag that I use. It is from Amazon and it's also very, very popular. I believe it has five full stars right now if you guys have seen my cruise must-have videos or pack with me for my cruise video you guys are very familiar with this I will forever stand by this bag I've been using it for years now and I will recommend it to anybody and everybody it does come in some great color choices this is just my signature dust pink color so of course I had to get it it's got some gold zipper detailing as well handles right here and right now it's actually on sale I believe it's 13% off and it's $27.99 for this large sized one and they do have it in a medium as well I think that one's on sale for $22 or $23.99 so definitely check it out on Amazon if you're interested and snag it while it's on sale I'll leave the link down below for you guys so let's go ahead and jump right in immediately you can see that there are handles to this to make it easy to pick up and just grab take on the go it's got this pocket back here where I keep my Lysol wipes. This is just where they stay for easy access. So it does have the hanger hook right here so you can hang it on a door or on a towel rack so all of your items could stay off of the countertops and you can have more space to get ready. And this is what I love about this the most and it's pretty sturdy. I've pretty much hung this everywhere we've went and it has yet to cause any type of breakage and I have it pretty much um, packed to the fullest so that says a lot about the quality and it's got four pockets as you guys can see here's the very bottom right there so I'm just gonna go ahead and start off with the very top if you guys are OG Victoria's Secret shoppers you guys will recognize these little type of chiffon little satchel bags this is where they actually used to keep the extra little straps they would give you with the boss that you purchased and I used to work there so I've got a ton of these first one the pink one I just keep my cotton pads in and then this one I keep my cotton balls in some floss and then this nude one I've got my hair ties I've got some of these pointed q-tips and then I've also got the regular q-tips and then lastly I've got these little waxing strips I actually ended up picking up from Target it's got a total of 12 hypoallergenic wax strips this is just a great product altogether to have on the go you could use it on the face or if you're going to a tropical destination and you're going to be basically half naked in a swimsuit all the time this is perfect to clean up little other areas next zipper area is one of the larger ones and it has just this main zipper right here so I just like to keep a slew of masks on hand whether it's a foot mask a face mask uh, eye patches I just love having these on hand because whenever you're traveling you tend to not take care of your skin as well as you would if you were home so I think this really helps rehydrate all of your body parts immediately so I love having these and plus it's like the last thing I like to do at the end of the night to kind of help relax and pamper me a little bit and you can see at the very front right there there's a cute little sloth that is my daughter's so we actually like to do little face masks at night together I do try to keep it a little bit more organized with a rubber band around all of them and then of course I've got to have quick makeup wipes on hand especially when I'm wearing face makeup it's just much easier to get off with a wipe and then I've got my cute little loofah my toothbrush of course I just keep it in a case like this so that any type of debris, dirt, anything doesn't get all over it. I want to say for about a week's worth of travel, one and a half of these usually work for my husband and I and then our kids usually get their own little one. I've got my little shampoo and conditioner bottles, body wash. I always like to bring my own just because I never know how good the ones that they provide at the hotels or in ships. Then a razor and then this is one of my new favorites. It is a shaving cream by EOS. It is made by the same brand that makes an amazing chapstick that we have come to know. Next I've gotta have a full-sized bottle of soap that has a pump on it 
just because whenever you go to a hotel you're most likely going to get a bar of soap and that's just not as sanitary a pump is just much more preferable for me and especially when we have little children it's just much easier for them to use and then i've got this little face wash and then last but not least in this large pocket is going to be my nail grooming kit and this one i picked up from i want to say tj maxx i took some out and only kept my essentials so I like to have nail clippers, of course, that's the most important. And then I've got these trimming scissors, which I actually usually almost always end up using for clothing. So I love having these on hand. And then I don't usually use this kind of nail filer for my nails. However, I find that I use it mostly as a tool, whether I'm as like a flathead or trying to get into little smaller places that my fingernails can't get to. But basically, I use it as an actual tool for other materials besides my actual nails and then my actual little mini nail filer I like to use for my nails and this one did not come with this set so the second portion is now all empty and as you guys can see there are these little banded little straps you can actually insert things in and there's a double row of them so depending on the size of your product it's very very nice to have it all situated so you can see exactly what you've got and kind of make note of what you're actually missing so now we are on the third compartment <laughs> And as you can see, there are going to be double zippers, the top right here and on the bottom. And that is just for easy access in case something does fall to the bottom. You don't have to kind of dig from this side only. So it's really nice that they did that. And this also has the double row of straps back there as well so you can organize your items. So we're gonna go dig right in, see what's in here. So these little sugar bear sleeping gummies are the best things ever and they do work so i recommend these and then i've got a few hair products here are some mousse this one is mostly for my daughter dry shampoo my hair tends to get very very greasy and next i've gotta have some hairspray just for more of like out in the town and formal nights then i've got some micellar water and this just makes my face feel extra extra clean and then i've also got some makeup remover my favorite one is actually the Target brand one is some potpourri with a little poop decal that I put on there. I usually get the large size potpourri spray, but it's a little bit too large. I don't need all of that. So I like transferring it in here because this is actually the same one that I end up putting in my work bag when I'm not on vacation. So I transfer this back and forth. Potpourri is definitely one of my favorite things, especially on travel. You kind of really don't know what you're going to encounter when you're out and about wherever you may be sometimes i just cannot absolutely stand the smell so having that is just a lifesaver next i've got some peroxide and i have it in the same little size as i have this potpourri i love having peroxide because it is a multi-use product for healing purposes and cuts and things like that and it's actually much easier to spray it right onto the wound and also because it is great for stains i found that peroxide just works really really well on most types of stains so i like having this especially with the little ones around so that's definitely a great little hack next i've got my little native mini on the go deodorant and i just love this one and then i've got more hair products this is a heat protector spray and again this is a set that i picked up from amazon i'll list it below everything i have here will be listed down below so you don't have to go hunting for it anywhere and if i cannot find it i'll have something similar so no worries it's down there in the box and then i've got this hair oil that i've had for years now but it works just as well as when i first got it so i use it this is perfect especially if you're going to tropical destinations and your hair just gets extremely dry and you're out swimming all day long this is just a great way to kind of help your hair rehydrate then i've gotta have a mini lint roller just because it's just the moment i don't have one this is the exact moment that i'll need it the most next i've got some face care products this one i picked up from i want to say tj maxx it's a collagen with retinol night serum and then i've got a rose and vitamin e oil and then olay i just love what they have then you gotta have some fresh tears just in case you get something in your eye then these little magical atomizers that i have oh my gosh i cannot rave about these 
more than I already do. They are my absolute favorite. So the way it works is that you just take any perfume that you have, you place this on top and push down on it and it'll automatically transfer to this bottle and now you have your own little high-end atomizer whatever your favorite perfumes are stop buying the little mini bottles and get these off of amazon whoever came up with these you are heaven sent because these are absolutely perfect i've never had any type of leakage issue this one right here this is the one i actually try to distinguish from the other ones and you see stars on it because it's supposed to denote night so this is actually a sleep spray so it's supposed to induce sleep it's got i want to say like lavender and other essential oils in it i want to say it's the one that i got from um, bath and body works and it works really really well so i like it and this is perfect again for vacation just to kind of give you that extra layer of relaxation at the end of the night especially when your brain's all wired that is it for that compartment now we're moving on to the very last one down here this one just has my little sleeping eye mask super super soft gotta have that when you travel and then my little hair turban that i've just had for a year so i need to replace it sometime soon but it works great so we'll keep it around for a little bit longer and if any of you guys caught on i do not have any makeup or any type of sunscreen in here and that is because those are in a different toiletry bag I guess I can go really quickly through them just to kind of show you how I have it. They all don't fit in here, obviously. Um, I won't show you my little makeup case just because that can be in a video all on its own. But it is in my cruise must-haves video, so I will also drop that video down below. So when I say my other toiletry bag, I meant my three, but I'm going to go through it very quickly. Don't let it scare you. <laughs> Um, I do tend to overdo it sometimes, but at the same time, these are my essentials for my family that I just have to have on me. Obviously, you don't have to get all of this, but this is also something that might interest you and something that you may end up wanting to pack in your own toiletry bag. But I think it's definitely worth showing you guys these, so I'll just go through them very quickly. This first little one, I've just got my feminine products, and I just prefer having this in an entirely separate little thing like this. I can just throw it right into my beach bag, or if I'm going out for the night, I can throw it right into my purse and I'll have everything that I need because this is the last thing I would want to ever forget. It. my next one i just keep all of our medicines i've got like my pill box in here and other little helpful aids it's got a first aid kit tummy drop some icy hot kids cold medicine flu medicine i go through everything that i have in here in my cruise must-haves video so again check that out if you're interested in seeing everything that's in here and again everything i've got in there i'll also link down below for you guys in its own little category so you can find it very easily and this last one i like to call it like my little beach go-to type of toiletry bag i like to have this one set up so i can grab it take it to the beach with us or to the pool and it'll just be a very quick thing to do rather than just pulling everything out of this larger toiletry bag and accidentally leaving something behind so that's why i have it all separate gotta have my hydration accelerator this is perfect for just when you need the extra hydration or especially if you guys decide to have some adult drinks this is a perfect supplement for that to kind of get you back up to normal um, i could not recommend this more then aloe um, no matter what i've got to have aloe there's been instances where we actually all burned as a family so i love having this then usually i just bring a multitude of sunscreen with us because i'm neurotic and sometimes depending on what country and international waters you're going into you have to have very specific ones that are reef safe so definitely make sure you are checking on the guidelines for those places and i like to have a separate one for my face i like to do the sun bum one and then next are more lysol wipes because i like to have some specifically for this bag in case i need to wipe down surfaces where we're going to eat beach chairs loungers things like that this is just a lifesaver. Then I've got some Ziploc reusable baggies. I find that these are just very useful to keep things in that we don't want to get wet. So I do have these in a few different sizes. Maybe we've got some cash we want to throw in here. 
or maybe I want to keep my bathing suits in here just in case we just went swimming and now we want to go change into some dry clothes and go to a restaurant, do a little shopping, I can immediately do that. And now the rest of our items and our regular beach bag will not be soaked. Last but not least, I've got some anti-monkey butt. This is a great way to wick off some sweat. Essentially, it works just like baby powder, but this one has some calamine lotion in it. So it is actually advertised as a skin soother and a sweat absorber. So it definitely it does all of that. Just to reiterate, I do have a trio of these toiletry bags. Uh, these ones I purchased in store, but if I can find something within the same shape family and a trio of something very similar, especially this shape one right here, for your feminine products, I'll definitely link it down below just because I found this little method right here very, very useful and just efficient. And if you guys have any other great suggestions, make sure to put it in the comments down below so the rest of the viewers can see it and kind of try new things out. But that is pretty much it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and got a lot out of it and found it very, very helpful. If you haven't subscribed already, please feel free to do so. I'd love to have you stay for a while and see your beautiful faces again. Thank you guys so, so much and I'll see you in the next video.